Hi, my name is Raymond Jisuf and I am Timothy. Now I'm going to go in over a rundown of the acting performances from major characters in the short film Timothy. Well, I basically appear on screen for the major percentage of this film because, well, I am Timothy. Now, for to become this role, I kind of embraced a I kind of embraced method acting. I had to become this character for the couple of days that we were shooting this film. So before shooting this film, I used to walk around the neighborhood with a cap on my head. But a week prior to shooting this film, I had to remove my cap and see how people would react to me having a very weird hairstyle like that on my head. So that actually gave me an insight to how people deem, to how people deem characters in our own real world with those kind of weird hairstyles. Now, I became this character and on a couple of days on our way to set, I, I wave like I wave randomly at people. There was this one time where I waved at a girl who was smiling originally and when she sees me, her face turns from a smile to a frown. It was actually quite funny for me and in that moment I had to actually laugh a lot and immediately after playing the character Timothy, I came back to the normal me. Now I'm going to be breaking my performances from my favorite scenes in the film. Now I'm going to begin with the first scene. So the first scene was a very tough scene because I had to improvise all the lines I said in that particular scene. But funny enough, most of the lines were later redubbed because we kind of had like a bad sound issue for that particular scene. It was very hard trying to maintain a good emotion and also saying all these lines that did not mean anything to me <laughs> personally. I considered it kind of like acting and it was the first scene we shot while making this film. So we shot the first thing and the first thing and I was still on my process. I was still in the process of trying to get into character as this particular actor. Now we kind of advanced from these scenes into like scenes I was kind of natural with which were the um, crowd um, the outdoor, legit outdoor scenes where you see a lot of people walking about, um, some extras that are not really extras. And I, it, it was one of those moments where I was free, you know. My heart wasn't beating at a very fast rate because I kind of felt comfortable and I was like, man, I'm doing this role, so y'all should not look at me like as if I'm some madman in real life. Some people actually thought I was going crazy while we were shooting this film. So I guess I really stayed in character for a good while. And I had to walk around in like this torn trouser and this messed up jacket with no underwear at all. So it was a really crazy experience playing this role. Um, from these scenes, we moved on to the chase scenes and for the chase scenes, we had to incorporate dialogues so that our chasing has some sort of substance to him and you can hear my character subtly telling the guys chasing him to leave me alone because normally when such characters chase you in real life, they kind of get tired and not stop but these particular guys were keen on chasing our character to the extent it led to his demise. Now, playing the demise was kind of like a easy tax for me because when I knew that I had lost my leg for some reason I was able to channel a lot of pain to my character and I gave this loud scream and in my head I was like where is this coming from and all so that was actually a very um, cool scene to shoot um, crying and pretending to be in pain actually um, made me feel something I could not only help but wonder people who had gone through this sort of similar pain and how they were able to handle these situations and that kind of like inspired me when I was plunging into the depths of the sad Timothy. I am a very jovial person in real life so when you see the outtakes from shooting Timothy, I am actually laughing immediately after I'm shooting sad scenes. I'm glad that did not affect my performance and people kind of consider those scenes emotional. So it means so much to me. In fact, there's a particular scene in Timothy when my <laughs> when the Baba Usman begins to cut my hair, I give this little smile that I had to remove in the edit so that it doesn't kill the flow of my character sadness. And when the clipper like touched my hair, I had not barbed in like three months and it just kind of felt funny that this was what we were shooting. <laughs> this was what we were shooting this for like we are shooting barbing my hair and I almost laughed but I had to quickly get back into character and channel all the sad moments in my life so that 
I will be able to bring out this emotional side of Timothy. Um, it's kind of very jovial, like immediately after the director yells cuts and we're all laughing. But when the camera starts rolling, it's like a whole different version, you know, we're kind of entering this whole other universe and we're just trying to bring in all our in-game to make this seem very good. Um, one of my favorite scenes to shoot was the conversation scene. It was like a real full circle moment for us. You know, when we started shooting this scene, we wanted to incorporate Latin language. And I know that like most of us thought that it was going to sound like stupid. I was actually sounding stupid when we were shooting too. For like the first couple of takes, we were just laughing and couldn't keep our serious faces for a very emotional scene. So let them do this. Brother. No less it is a liquid square cosa. See the glitter suit the quay period. It's kind of cool for me because I knew how casual and how free we were when shooting this scene. And when you see this particular scene in the film, it feels like we are all going through very dark moments in our life and that means so much. In fact, it means so much to me that since we put out this film, a lot of people have been commenting on the fact that my acting was good and I'm like, maybe I should, maybe I should look into acting more. And maybe I might, I might succeed, but who, who knows what is to come, Sha? So yeah, thank you all for the kind words. Um, the next thing that was kind of like a bit challenging challenging and was something I was looking forward to was the crutches scene. So the only time you see my character working with crutches is when he's in the forest following his brother blindly. Now for that scene I had to actually raise my leg throughout shooting that scene. So I get the kind of feeling somebody with one leg has. I'm very grateful for the opportunity to play Timothy. Thank you all.